So my friends, I've got a little bit of a problem today. My problem is that my base up here is entirely pointless. You guys pointed out in the comments over and over again that, well, meows don't work with skills on ranches. And that's kind of annoying because I spent eight hours trying to breed Lucky Charm and his friends. Yeah, evidently these skills that he have to make his work speed faster, that doesn't work on the ranch. They just dig whenever they want to. And not only that, but if I come down here to my iron mine, I have another problem. These dig toys are actually terrible at digging. Look at that, they only do two damage per time at these rocks. Now it does add up over time, but it's not as profitable as making an Anubis farm, which we're gonna do today. But before we start this saga of breeding the perfect Anubis, I'd like to thank Guild Saga Vanished Worlds for sponsoring today's video. Guild Saga Vanished Worlds is a brand new tactical RPG for PC, where you're a newcomer to the Heroes Guild and chosen for an important mission to unravel the mystery and make your way towards an uncharted continent that's full of danger and opportunity. And as you can imagine, the game is full of fantasy elements that bring players complex combat, customizable progression, and it's all set in this really fun, unique pixel art style. The gameplay blends tactical turn-based combat with deep player customization. Also, there's a ton of fun little companions you can get with you, and they have a ton of customization as well. So you can really carve out your own distinct path through the game's rich and mysterious landscapes. Also, there's loot. Lots and lots of loot, which I love. I didn't mention it before, but there is a free demo for this game that you can play today. If you click on that link down below in the video description, you can try out the free demo for Guild Saga Vanish Worlds on Steam. You can also add the game to your Steam wishlist while you're there, as the game does come out later this year in April. So this is kind of one of the exploits that'll probably get fixed in the future, but if I build up a nail here, and then I quickly build it, my goodness, they made that so fast. We can take that nail to a merchant like this wandering one over here and sell it to them for a solid 160 gold each, which is actually pretty insane. That kind of makes me want to bring this merchant home with me. Hello, Mr. Merchant, would you like to come Come home with me. I better get something that's not as damaging as a legendary weapon for a level 10. So let's just kind of mine you for a little bit. Uh oh. Wow. Everyone immediately got mad at me. Hello. I just need this merchant. Guys, it'll be okay. I promise. Here. You join me with a legendary spear. That's not very good. That's a 16% chance. Oh, balls. This is going to be hard, isn't it? I swear. I just want the. Not you. I want the merchant. Oh. It'll be okay. Just give me the merchant. I have nobody will get hurt, I promise. All right, maybe I need a different sphere, hyper spheres. I don't want to waste all my legendary ones. Ooh, yeah, that's the same percentage chance. Why are you so difficult right now? No! Shoot. Well, we'll get a different one at a different time. Excuse me, fellas, I'm out of here. It would be a shame if all of those people came back to my camp here and were immediately destroyed by my overwhelming army. Yeah, <laughs> the Anubises are having fun, my goodness. Wow. All right, even the black market trader is deciding to attack them. Nope, he's just standing there. He's like, I'm totally gonna collect you and bring you back for science problems. This gives me bad ideas. This gives me really bad ideas. But that might be in a different video and we attempt those other ideas. I hope more don't respawn. I think we may have just won the battle. Now everyone's hungry. <laughs> Same. So essentially what my idea is that I want to create these Anubises and make them really, really strong. I've been doing a little bit of breeding off screen, but I think we need to start with having some good Ragnahawks. Not like this one, who's just kind of dumb and stuck over here. You're not smart, but maybe one of your babies will be smart. Artisan and Workslave, that's actually the exact one I wanted. It's kind of crazy when you get both of them having the same stats like that. But since I do have a few more eggs, I might as well incubate them too. And if you were wondering, ooh, that one's swift as well. If you were wondering, I have the world settings, so there is no timer for incubation. It just makes it easier when I'm making videos. Also, don't play on public servers, just don't. So I'm hoping since this Cinemoth is a lucky, then we should get some good stats here on this large egg. Come on, let's see, let's see, let's see. Get lucky artisan and work slave. Artisan, work slave, burly body. Didn't get lucky on there. Sorry, Mossanda, you're not the one I'm looking for. Also, I need a better Google glider. Do I even have the better gliders unlocked? There's the Giga Glider. I've got a good feeling about this egg, though. A really good feeling about this egg. I just need to Spider-Man my way over there. I don't know why I don't move that breeding thing. Like, why do I run back and forth every single time? I have to climb up on the roof and then sit here and incubate the egg. I need to move it. 
And it gives me, ooh, Lucky and Logging Foreman. That's not quite it either, but the Lucky is super nice. Why don't I just put this, you know, somewhere a little bit closer? Get out of the way, Van Worm. Nobody likes you. It's for real this time. I just need you to move and not just flap in place. Go play in traffic or something. Drum roll. Lucky Artisan Work Slave with Bottomless Stomach. That's a pretty good combination. Okay, so if I combine that one and yeet. With, I believe it is a catrus. With a catrus like one of these. I always think catrices are female, but I only have male catrices. So that's not quite the ma moss panda I need. So I could just put some moss pandas together. And I think these things are adorable. They're one of my favorite. Just because they're big and goofy looking, much like myself. So let's incubate another moss and egg and give me something cool. Lucky artisan work slave conceded. That's actually the ones I need. Are you a male or a female, buddy? You are a male. Is that what I needed? I physically don't remember. Okay, so my other male is lucky work slave artisan. This one's lucky artist. It's the same. It, they're the same thing. All right, looks like another egg is ready. Hopefully this is a good one. This has got to be close over here too. Nope, never mind. <laughs> but let's try this out. Large egg. I'm just hoping for the four skills that we need. And artisan, serious, work slave, cold blooded. That we, we have that one. Like they're almost identical, except a little bit back. Anyway, it's time to change things up here a little bit. I'm gonna put all of these guys to the pasture because they're <laughs> extremely unhealthy right now. Uh, it's so much more peaceful here now. Except when you're dumb dumb, you get stuck on the rock. Now, I'm not sure where I want this, but I totally am gonna build a production assembly line here somewhere. Maybe up here in these trees? This could be a good spot for it. Like right about here. Very nice. Is anyone gonna help me? Oh yeah. Whatever pal that is is coming. Kit soon? Wixen. That's what I said. That's what I that's what I meant. I'm also wondering if this thing requires electricity. I didn't think about that. Not enough electricity. Balls. I'm assuming the electric furnace needs electricity too. So I'm just gonna have the Anubises start mining. I'll be real, none of these are very good. Like at all. That one's got serious skill, that one's a glutton. Okay, we have one that's, yeah, okay. You're gonna go here, you're gonna go here. We have one that's serious. Oh, that's so much faster. This is looking nice. We actually don't even need the Van Worm, or we could. I like how we have the bosses in here too. By the way, that's the only way to capture these is you go take out the bosses. My goodness, these guys are good at this. <laughs> I wanna see what happens when all of it gets done. This is so much faster and these aren't even leveled up nicely. They are just destroying those rocks and I think once they do it, they're just gonna grab all of the resources and oh my word, immediately haul it instantly. That is so cool, look at that army of Anubis. Now we need to level these guys up all the way. <laughs> They're having so much fun, look at them all go. And the Bronx chair is like, I just like walking. But I am gonna build up a power generator, I'm not sure exactly where to put it. Let's put it next to the bathtub because nothing could go wrong with that. I wanna see them build this thing too. <laughs> yes! I'm gonna sort, actually I'm not gonna sort. I wanted to sort by element type. There's the Rayhound, which is a level two. The Univolt's a level two as well. We have the Grizzbolts, which are a level three, but this guy, the Ors, or Orserk. Yeah, he'll work. Now I'm hoping you're gonna run over there and start generating electricity. Who's that guy, boy? Yeah. Oh wow, he enjoys that a lot. Okay, one more egg, give me. Nope. Oh man, why do I only get three of the four? I need all four. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Give me all four. Give me all four. I want all four. Lucky diet lover. That's not any of the ones I wanted. But what I do want is to turn these primitive furnaces into little better furnaces. Give me that. Give me that. And then I don't have enough polymer to make this, but we'll just make one of these real quick. That should be pretty good. I'll let these bros finish it off in just a second. My goodness, you guys are good at building things and mining things. All right, I feel like we can turn one of these Anubises into a, a fire pal. And if we do that, we might as well take a nice one. Like you, Jormund Tidingus. Now, fella, it's gonna be your job to burn all of these ingots into, well, all of it into ingots, I think. I don't know. Max, start production. Come on over here, Dingus. Not you, Wixen. You're not, you're not great at this. Wixen about to be fired. Okay, I mean, you're not too bad. I just don't need you when we have a giant dragon here with legendary fire skills. 
Not not you either, Van Worm. We don't need you either. There we go. Dragon time. <laughs> Look how fast that goes. All right. I'll take 130. You're so fast. We're going to put these over here and make these nerds turn it into nails. Okay, that's going to be 465 nails. My goodness, this is going to be a lot of money. All right, friends. <laughs> Look how fast we're making the nails. Hot dang, that's incredible. This is going to weigh a lot too, which is entirely why I hope this merchant has respawned. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got him mad at me. Excuse I'm just assaulting one person. Thank you. All right, let's get some hyperspheres going. Get captured, please. I'm stronger than all of you combined. Plus, I have literal dragons on my team. Why did I use lift monk effigies? Why did I use them? My capture rate's so bad. Oh, nice shot. Oh? Nope, not quite. What are you doing up there, friend? Come on, come on, get captured. <laughs> Watery merchant, I gotta run. Excuse me, sir, don't mind me. <laughs> Your guards are, he's actually, that guy needs to be fired and out of a cannon. Oh yeah, I wanted to bring him back here just to see what kind of madness would happen if all of these Anubises just went to town. Oh my goodness, that guard is getting destroyed down there. <laughs> Even a Kilmari, he's like, yep, I'll just shoot my little ball at you. Is that all of them? Do we, do we end them? Do we end their careers? All right, fellas, you've had enough playtime. Get home and start working again. The guard is literally up here, you dinguses. Fellas, over here. I gotta refresh them because their brains are broken. It's working. It's working. I thought it was working. They have the dumbs in them. Thankfully, pathfinding at my main base is a little bit easier and we took out all the guards. Also, we have way more eggs. That's fun. You guys have been busy. That's what inbreeding's for. Please, just give me the four things that I need. The four that I need. That's one. You can't count very high. That's what happens when they get inbred. It is so hard to get the perfect skills. It really is. Oh, that's pretty good, but not what I need. The good news is I can let this watering merchant go free here at the base. There you are, just wandering around. Why are you on fire? I could pick up the 930 nails and then zip line over the wandering. Why are you taking damage? Are you taking damage? Are you just gonna go commit Sudoku? Give me this. I have some good items in stock, me too. They're called nails. And they're worth 150,000 money. That was good. Also, we have 257 more ingots, which means I can make up uh, an entire buttload more nails. Oh my word, look how fast it's going. Oh, that's pure money being rained right there. So that took all of about 37 seconds to make 500 nails. Also, my weight capacity is way too much, but I have the grappling hook, so it'll work out just fine. No, 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 come back here. You're walking so fast. Why are you so fast? Oh, you turned. I'm gonna cut him off. Yes. That's another 82,000. Beautiful. Now I do need to buy more ammo. Ooh, fire crossbow. Beautiful. 400 handgun ammo in my pants. Yeah. And now the trouble is getting the right candidates to make the perfect Anubis. Could this be the egg that we're looking for? Lucky artisan work slave Zen mine. That one's not bad. And since we have a money farm that's working way better than this one, unfortunately, we get to destroy it. Aww. And if we're gonna destroy it, we might as well combine all of those pals into one. If I can find the pal condenser. There it is. Not gonna lie, I almost feel bad. I almost, do. Um, just barely. Because all of these things are gonna go be combined into this guy right here. All right, Lucky Charm, I'm sorry about this, but you're gonna lose all of your siblings. Yep, those will all disappear. All right, so Lucky Charm is now a two star, which is pretty solid. His friends weren't so lucky though. Now I have to clean up all of this mess. Find it funny, I spent eight hours so I could generate 7,000 gold per second, or per, per hour. And I mean, it kind of worked okay but not nearly as good as the nail farm is. Especially when I get better Anubises in there. Not gonna lie, I'm a little bit sad about this because it took forever to make. Oh, hello, dig toys. <laughs> what are you, what are you doing here? <laughs> are you helping me? What are you, oh, I'm so, I'm so big here. Have you, Lucky Charm, help. Nope. Wait, what am I doing? Why don't I just stab him with a sword or shoot him in the face with a pistol? I forget how to play this game sometimes. Hello, Mr. Wandering Merchant. I have a question for you. Would you like to come visit my base permanently? <laughs> if I shoot you in the head, you're gonna explode. Ooh, actually a level 16. Might actually be able to take a few hits. Let's try a legendary sphere in the back. 
All right, 15% chance. That's really expensive. I knew it wouldn't work. All right, come down here. Don't alert any of your friends. Oh, balls. I'll just use hyperspheres instead. Yeah, that's the same rate. I'm gonna hide over here. Please don't hit me. I didn't do anything wrong. I just wanna go kidnap this person. Did I say that out loud? It's actually working. Oh, hot dang, two spears. Yes. Woo! Thank you. I really appreciate that you came to visit us. Now I can buy unlimited amounts of pal oil whenever I want to. Mmm, it's high quality stuff. And since I, you know, just have like pretty much unlimited money now. Wow, I can make $9.99. I really only want like a couple hundred. So I could tell my dinguses to make up some polymer and it would be so helpful if we had better Anubises. And I really want this egg to have all four things on it so I can make a better one. Oh, bottom, okay. Serious, that has three. Wait, actually that might work perfectly. Depending on the gender, let's have a baby reveal party. We've got a girl. Is that mixed with this one? Ooh, okay. Serious artisan, work slave, artisan, work slave. Ah, I need lucky on there. I need a lucky serious one and I am not getting it. Come on, lucky serious. Come on, lucky serious. Come on, lucky serious. That's a serious ferocious. That's just as much as not wanting it. Good news, everyone. I just got a lucky serious male. I am not sure how that's gonna work with that because two males can't make a female or something. Oh, why? Actually, if I put these two together, would they make me another Lucky Serious? They might. So we're gonna attempt that. Make a baby. So I just came to check on the Anubis farm. It's kind of weird, but they managed to, uh, they mine everything when you're not here, but <laughs> they forget to haul it until you get here. I have no idea why that is. It's like they travel in a pack mentality. Look at the little fellas go. They run back and they run forth. Then they run back and they run forth. Then they run back and they run forth. And then I come over here and I tell them to, well, make up a bunch more ingots like such as maximum 212. It's totally not even the right number, but you know what I meant. I just love their stupid little anime run. <laughs> it's like, why, why do they have to run like that? It's also crazy how much XP that uh, Moss Panda is making. <laughs> oh, level 16. Well done, thank you for that. And we'll take this, we're gonna make some nails out of it because everyone's cleaned everything up. And our friendly Moss Panda is just speed leveling this. Look at that go. Also look how fast those nails are being created. That's incredible. This is definitely way better than the Diggy Boys that we had before. Now, where is that salesman at? Would you like some more nails? Bet you would. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's awesome. The other fun thing is I'm really close to getting a good Catrus here. And then we'll be able to combine the Catrus and the Mossanda to build the Anubis's Artisan Work Slave. That's exactly what we needed. And we got the bonus XP, sick. So I've got two Artisan Work Slaves here. One's a male, one's a female. I also have a Lucky Sirius male and female. So these two together, switch. These two together should be able to make all four of the things we need. Just get in there, you dingus. Actually, we got another egg too. Okay, then you two make some sort of weird mutant child. And the same with you two. I'll just not watch because it gets awkward. Plenty more cake for them to have fun with. And now we have a quest to make the best Anubis ever. Oh, we don't have legend yet. We'll get that in the next video. All right, I'm pretty excited for this. We have, ooh, we have a few of them. I went farming for some pal fluids. Not here at the farm, that'd be even more awkward than this has already gotten today. But we do have three eggs and I'm hoping for Artisan, Lucky, Serious, and I don't know, Work Slave, that's the other one. We got two of the four. I'm also hungry, like in real life, not just in the game. Okay, Luckily and Fragrant Foilage. Why, why is that a thing? Come on, Lucky Work Slave. So that's two of the four that we need, Woo. hot dang. We're getting there. So I might let these guys breed a little bit while I stepped out to lunch and, oh, <laughs> I keep forgetting. I have a few eggs. Yeah, it'll be exciting, I promise. There's a lot of Anubises here. This one is, oh, Work Slave Lucky Diet Lover. All right, I don't care about Burly and Diet Lover. Ooh, Artisan Serious? My goodness, this is gonna get weird. Hopefully we get just one of them that's the right things. That one's definitely not. That boy's just serious. And, oh great. This is gonna get really bad, isn't it? None of these are gonna work and I'm gonna sit here for another hour. At least I'm getting lucky on them, which is not natural in the world. Ooh, serious and work slave. That's two good ones. Oh, there's two again. 
We're getting there. We're so close. All right, a lucky artisan is a good one. That's really good. And work slave serious. Oh, those two together with the lucky artisan. That could create a, a four star. Not a four star. That's kind of what I'm calling it though. All right. I gotta organize these. So good news, I have four of these that have, well, all four of the traits. Lucky, work slave, artisan, serious. This is the same, lucky, work slave, and an artisan, serious. So I'm gonna put these in and start making babies like this. Where'd that one go? Oh, here you are. Whoa, 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 Come, why do you run so fast? Get in there, you filthy animal. Stop, no, not with the moss and that's weird. No way, no way. No way, it's just, I just got it. <laughs> I just got it. I have been breeding so many flippin' eggs all day long. Oh, that's it. Lucky, serious, artisan, work slave. Actually got it. Hot dick, look at, look at all of these Anubises that I've bred. <laughs> there's, there's a uh, six, 12, then 50, uh, I got, there's a bunch of them. <laughs> but we got it. Oh my goodness. Lucky, serious, artisan, work slave. That's the perfect combo right there. We have plus 20, plus 30, plus 15, and plus 50. So 115% work speed on this thing? <laughs> I need to know. I need to know for science purposes. How fast does it actually build things? Um, let's see, select a recipe. Should we just do one pal sphere? Okay, someone else is coming over for it, but you won't make it. And it's already done. Hold on, do it again. Ready, get set, start production. <laughs> Instantly. All right. Uh, how about an ultra sphere? Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me right meow? That's incredible. All right. I need to, I need to do like a stack of legendary. Do I need Here, I have an idea. Here, buddy. You come here. You're going to be building me some carbon fiber. I believe I have some. Uh, not with coal. We're not wasting coal, but I should have some charcoal ready. Oh yeah. Plenty of it. Boink. Carrying too many items. No, I'm not. Not when I can fly. All right, slap that in there. All right, Mr. Anubis. <laughs> Mrs. Anubis, sorry. Uh, I'll just try this. Max out. And... Oh, we don't want coal. Here we go. Charcoal. Max the charcoal. <laughs> it is stupidly fast. Look at that XP gain, too. Like, every one of these going up is another level. I like how the bar doesn't even go to the end. It's like, yeah, good enough. You've completed it. There we go. Carbon fiber for me. Carbon fiber for free. Now let's see how long it takes him to build a couple legendary spheres. All right. Here, buddy. Have fun. These things take like a minute each, usually. <laughs> it's like 10 seconds. That's so great. Oh, my word. That took forever to get. Now the question is, can I clone him? Her. Can I clone her? So this is its first offspring. Let's see if it gives good stats or not. It's probably just gonna be like something dumb. Lucky, yeah, why those, those don't even exist on you. Hmm, I'm not exactly sure, but I did have something interesting to think about here. If I grab that pal metal ingot, I wanna show how slow this is to do by hand and you can compare to the other one. Oh, but I need three more. We'll try one more of these eggs before we go mass uh, produce, or I don't even know, condense? Mass condense our queen. Lucky, artisan, that's another one. <laughs> is that a male? Is this a male? If it's a male, then we have a pair. I don't even know where it is. Right here, we have a male and we have a female. That's literally the same one, isn't it? Oh, hot dang. Hold up, hold up, come back here, sir. This is awkward. I know the game doesn't have proper genetics and all, but I believe this is called incest. Love is blossoming between the pair. Oh, look away, look away. That family tree runs deep. Or maybe I should say shallow, I don't know. All right, the first baby is here. It just popped out of nowhere. I don't know how that works, but we're gonna see. If this gives me all four, I'm gonna be so happy. Yeah, I didn't think it would. <laughs> the game doesn't uh, want to do nice things for us. But I do know one thing. I should look at both of these and figure out which one I want to modify. Because let's face it, I've got like 115 Anubis in here. There are so many of these stupid things. I'm wondering which one's better. Does it matter? I mean, this one has a, already a higher level. We should do that one. We're gonna name you uh, Queen Anubis. And my pal deck is entirely full, plus the 40 that I have at other bases. So let's let the condensation begin. All right, pal, you go in here. This is so wrong. 
But we just get to start combining everything. I don't even know. I kind of just... There's so many bad ones. There's so many good ones. I'll just get rid of the ones that don't have any good stats or only one of the good stat. There we go. Up to max health of 2,000 already. Condensation complete. Thanks to the noble sacrifices of all of its companions. Wow. So we got a three-star Queen Anubis here. That or Anubi. Um, and I don't know how many more. Like, I need to breed a bunch more just so we can satisfy the quest for 64 more. But that's not quite everything because, well, I spent another few hours AFKing last night building up more eggs and... Check this out. I did it. Got her up to four stars. But look at this. Handiwork five and mining four. I didn't realize the work suitability got updated as well. This thing is straight up insane. Go ahead. Bump over there. And let's see if you can make one of these. I need some palladium fragments. Hold on. Thankfully, there's eight in here. This is crazy how fast that she can work. Also, Dingus fez his head over there. Don't worry. Still working. All right. You ready for this? Let's just max out the production. We can only make three right now, but <laughs> all by the queen's self. Oh, the others have joined in. These legendary spheres were done in like three seconds. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> We've done it. We should actually take you. Hold on. Follow me. We have to go make some nails. I didn't have them make some nails when I was AFK too. <laughs> A thousand more. Hello, sir. Would you like to buy an industrial quantity of spiky metal things? That's just $168,000. Sell real quick. <laughs> that was great. But that's fine because I've got 1,600 more ingots here. My goodness. Ah! Maximum. Maximum overdrive. Go. Make <laughs> Look at how fast those snails are being built. My goodness. Every one of those is $160. Even the crafter, the merchant, wants to join in. Get 1,000. We are at two minutes and 35 seconds in this recording. I want to see how long it takes to make them all. And that was 25 seconds to make 1,000 nails. <laughs> this is so fast. Probably be faster if we remove that merchant too. Also, the fun thing is I have eight of the perfect Anubises now. I even named some of them like save one and save two, but there's eight of them with perfect stats. Hello, sir. Would you like to take these off my hands? That's right. We just made 526,000 money in a grand total of one minute. <laughs> that is so much fun. Anyway, my friends, that'll do it for today's video of Pal World. If you enjoyed this one, make sure you do check out Guild Saga Vanished Worlds down below. And thanks again to them for sponsoring this video. Thanks for watching and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank all my patrons and channel members, including Splatter Sax, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brett, Dalton C, Scatter D, Mr. Cripple One, Baton Please, Fussy Badge, Missing Sniper, Blank Hewitt, Tyler J, Nitro VR, Nitrox, Wyatt H, Otto Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippias, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Ritla Warrior, Keegan H, Zarnoff, Baxter, Ral, BC Engineer, Scars Marex, Spencer T, Whiskey, and YH. 